Okay, I need it. One quick minute. Babe, stop for a quick minute, please. Hey everyone, it's Emma Yummy 16 here, back at it again with another video playing Until Dawn. Okay, what? And Josh is on the phone, not in my party. Actually, you're still in a party, I'm just not in your party. <laughs> You are? on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class prez doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em, I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. weekend. Jeez, Josh. <laughs> Once again, brother, you've outdone us oh. all. Oh my god, what did our naive sister get herself into now? I've got your note. Glad you can make it. <laughs> hmm. 
maybe we should start with a little, you know, making out and see where it goes from there. Josh! Josh! Fuck! Guys! There's someone outside! What the hell? Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? <sighs> it's fine. She just can't take a joke. It was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We are just messing around, Dad. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike.
Begin. There are a few things I need to make sure you understand. You see, no one can change what happened last year. The past is beyond our control. Okay. You have to accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom in this revelation. Everything you do, every decision you make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember You're this. Dead. I want you to remember this. As you play your game, every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. So, you have committed to commence with this game. This is significant. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Mm -hmm. All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up a card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of this experience. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Make me happy. Oh, that's good. In what way did it make you happy? It's peaceful. Oh. Interesting. That's interesting. So, would it make you happy to spend the whole week here, all by yourself? Yeah. Huh. And what if I told you that this cottage was haunted? I wouldn't care. It would be uh, fun. A level-headed response. <laughs> but everyone is fighting on something. I wonder what it is that does frighten you. I really do. Okay. Sorry, we're out of time. Let's Darn. investigate that in our next session, shall we? No. Because you're an idiot. I don't like your tie. I don't like you.
Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy that took place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. This is an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much head. to me that we're doing this, and that and I know it would mean it all. so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, you know, thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each Spoiler and every one of you, Josh and, um, just share some moments all. that we'll never forget. Josh is all for, behind it. For the sake of my sisters, and, you know. Okay, so, let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes! Ten hours until dawn. What? <sighs> Damn it. Thanks, Chris. Oh, Jesus, never mind. <laughs> Google Prime. Yeah. 
You can so tell that somebody right there that's breathing and watching her. Aww. Hey, little fella. Should we you eat it? Just kidding. Huh? Oh, I never removed. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. That's it. Come on. Are you? Hello. What do we have here? Maybe I shouldn't look for that person's stuff. Chris. Sam. Hey, you made it. Thanks, Chris. How's it going? Ashley, protective. So, I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? <laughs> right around here. Going to blow your mind. Oh, man, look at this. Nice. You think we'll get a visit from America's most wanted? Like someone thought so. Ta-da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah! Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. All right, here goes. All right, here it goes. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. Not, I don't think so, girl. Uh, uh, 
Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. I guess we will shoot this poor squirrel. Bullseye! What are you doing? How could you do that? Chris, that is so effed up! What? That poor little guy was alive about ten seconds ago! Oh, come on. Squirrels are just rats with bushy tails. I cannot believe you just did that. Ah! Oh my god, what is that? Get it away! <sighs> Jesus, are, are you okay? This mountain is freaking me out already. <laughs> hey, hey, look. Our, our cable car is coming. Let's grab our ride. Okay, then. Man, it is... It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. Yeah, I swear, the moment I got here, it all came back. I wouldn't back. do it. Hey, that's weird. The door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. That's for you. Oh, real gentleman. was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm trying to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how rich you are. They're not so rich. They only bought a mountain. Stay here and catch some Z's, but okay. Well, it's just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right, adventure begins. Here oh, we go. This was the right thing to do. What? You know, get everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Uh, you know what, you're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap-snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. <laughs> I mean, and became friends. To this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her train bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Yeah, Mike's new 
girlfriend. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. Stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? That moment when I was about to scream, but I didn't. I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there, and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. Hey! <laughs> well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? Chris! My goodness! Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M split. We're together. Whoa. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Oh. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? <laughs> I mean, you know, whoever. Jesus uh, mercy! Sam? Did you see this view? I mean, don't like even how. say hi. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Yeah, after you gave Seriously, me an heart attack. They built the lodge like right where the cable car ends. Mike's ex. I don't think it would have been Emily. like it's pretty. Emily's new boyfriend, Matt. No. And where's the bellboy when you need one? <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh. Yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? Ah! <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> Mike. <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being, you always get like this. Michael, you gotta step off. Emily and I are together now, and that's just the way it is. I'm not gonna tell you again. Do we understand each other? Well, I thought maybe we could move past all this. It buds, but 
Yeah, fine. Mike. No, no, no. No, it's totally cool. I'm just gonna head down the road, be all mature and shit by myself over here. Peace. I think you got the message. <laughs> Kinda hot when you get all alpha, you know that? Oh, crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. All right. Fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, then we're even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. Hey. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Oh! Oh, God. <laughs> hey, whoa. <sighs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Just you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare God, you, but not Matt. like for real. Hi, babe. Gosh. Oh, my gosh. Hey, wow. Man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, Dan. It's okay, it's fine. What? What are you looking at? See anything juicy with us? I'm not uh, at a party with anybody. Let me check it out. Why? You wish. Um. Uh. Yep, yeah, it's kind of busted. It's not, it's not like really interesting. It's just. What? For real? Eh. I bet I could find like a cool bear chowing down on a fox or something. Okay, help yourself. Uh, sure. Help yourself. Oh. Son of a bitch. Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. Ah, I... Damn it. Matt. Jessica. Not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. The hell am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> great. Hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chicken? Oh, oh ah! I hey! Oh, snap! Oh, snap! <laughs> Hello, come on. <laughs> Hey, Mike! 
calling it my favor then you're a worthy opponent miss jessica the snowball queen okay that sounds vaguely dirty my lady <laughs> they're kissing wow save some for later buddy endless reserves we should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. <laughs> Scratch the surface in Are our last there? session, so let's go a little bit deeper this time. This time, Aren't you we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book. Turn oh, fine, and good night. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you well, to identify what? which image in each set makes you the most anxious. You have to wake up at five o'clock. Okay. Did I startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience.
This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Cockroaches, clowns, and crows. <laughs> Some combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> uh, well, I'm afraid, once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. He has something up his sleeve. Blackwood Winter Getaway. I really want to spend some quality time with each and every one of you and um, just no, share some moments that table. we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters. I need to go find Sam. Son of a bitch. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah? It feels the same to me. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, I, I'll fix you right up. Funny you should say that. I, oh, I think I left it in my other jacket. Oops. Hey guys. Get up here okay? Yeah. Well, more or less, but it is so good to see you. What's up with him? Yo, yo, yo. We get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. So Matt and Emily are a thing now, right? Yeah, so it seems. I mean, what's Mike think of that? I have a feeling Mike's already got his hands full, you know what I mean? Huh. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in. They're just all locked. There's gotta be, like, a window around the corner we can get, like, get open or something. Wait a second. Are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey. Not if I don't report you. Um, <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. You, you doing all right? Yeah, aside from being kind of cold and vaguely creeped out by this place. It's, it's kind of weird being back up here, huh? Yeah. Ashley was looking pretty hot today, right? Mm. She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? And I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Hey, cut it out, man. Yeah, I mean, if you're not gonna bang her, maybe Mike will take up the case. Wait, will you back off Relax. already? Relax. Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Yeah. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. 
You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Give it to her. <laughs> Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Koshi, or else you got four lovely ladies who are gonna be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. attention in climbing class. You mean Jim? Yeah, you know, with the climbing up the rope. Whoa. Did I do that? I, I don't think so. Here, use this. Whoa, Chris, I just got an awesome idea. Yeah? Totally. What, what, what is it? Okay, so... I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant gonna help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and push. Bye-bye frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm going to go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. Godspeed, Pilgrim. Chris, very funny. Oh, how'd you know it was me? Shouldn't you be, like, getting the lock open or something? On it. Thank <laughs> you. 
We're freezing our buns off out here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll, I'll be here all week. <laughs> ah, crap, that thing freaked me out. What was it? Are you okay? It was like a bear or a tiger or something. Oh, it was just a cute little baby Wolverine. Baby? Don't worry, buddy. You're gonna be a big boy soon. Home sweet home. Sweet is not the word I use. Oh my gosh, it's so good to be inside. Even if it's still kind of freezing in here. I'll get a fire going. This place barely looks any different. And yeah, nobody's been up here. Even with all the police coming in and out? Not a lot of action up here lately. Oh. <laughs> What's up, party people? Hi. Hey. Make yourself at home, bro. We'll do. Yeah. Come on in. Take a load off. Have whatever you want. You just take whatever you want anyway, right? Whoa. Easy there, cowboy. Mike, stay away from our girlfriend. Dude, what are you talking about? Stay away from Emily. Emily? Why would I want anything to do with Emily? Quit being such a dick, man. Nobody wants you here. Seriously, what's your problem, meathead? Son of a bitch! Hey, hey, get off me! Hey! What the hell is wrong with you two? We didn't come back here just to tear each other's heads off. I mean, we came back here to have a good time, right? Hey, Mike, why don't you and Jess go check out the guest cabin I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, cool. Want to head up there? Sure. So, Josh, uh, should we get this fire going? Where's my bag? Huh? My bag, the, the little bag with the pink pattern, the one I got on Rodeo. Matt, are you, are you listening? Oh my God, don't you remember? Next to the Italian shoe place where I got the stilettos and you knocked over the rack while you were drooling all over that girl at the counter. Well, I mean, 
She was asking about my letter jacket. Right, because she gave a shit about your designer letter jacket. Why do you hate my jacket? Matt, I need my bag. Oh my god, Em, you, maybe you just forgot it. Do you seriously think I'd forget my bag? Well, Do I... you? Guess not. You must have left it down by the cable car station. <sighs> Come on, hon. We'll be back soon. <sighs> then we can get warm. We can get very warm. Okay, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a bath. <sighs> Exiled. Exiled. <laughs> Works for me. Oh, far. How far is this? cabin anyway this cabin is the coziest most romantic love den you will ever lay your eyes upon <laughs> if we ever make it i have a feeling luck's on our side play your cards right and maybe you will get lucky hey porn stars you're gonna need these porn star i pay to see you uh gross hey i'm sorry to kick you out like that no worries man Oh, I'm sure you'll find a way to entertain yourselves. Mm-hmm. You have fun with the peanut gallery. <sighs> oh, I almost forgot. Gotta fire up the generator so you can see where you're going. It's dark out there. All right. Roger that. I think Josh was flirting with me. Okay. You want to invite him up with us? Wait, really? What? No. She has a crush on Josh. Hey, idiot. That's uh, a wall. Hey, Hot Lips. Photo booth? All right, read my mind. Oh my god. <laughs> this is perfect. We're like the cutest couple. Damn. You should be a model. You keep that camera handy, and maybe I'll let you start my portfolio at the cabin. Wink. Noted. <sighs> Burr, it is freezing out here. Now that's something I can help you with. And how are you going to do that? Uh, I got a few things in mind. So what the heck was all that muscle flexing back there with you and Matt? You know, just a little peacock action from a lady. Oh, really? That was all just to impress me? Well, you gotta <laughs> show off the goods when you gotta. <laughs> <sighs> okay, you seemed pretty PO'd there, stud. It was getting all territorial around M. What, am I not allowed to talk to her now that he's screwing her? Free country. Nice one, Mikey.
Shazam! The gates shall open. Pretty good, right? Yeah, totally. That was just awesome. Oh, yeah. I bring the hit. <laughs> you psyched yet? You don't look psyched yet. I am so psyched right now. <laughs> it's like a little adventure, a sexcapade. <laughs> clean it up. Well, they never close the investigation. Okay, I'm getting the creeps now. It's all such a blur. I can barely even remember what happened. Well, what I remember is that we played a stupid half-baked prank that probably got Hannah and Beth killed. Hey, I mean, it's not our fault they ran into the wood. Yeah. How could anyone have expected them to do a dumb thing like that? Um, did you hear that? I heard something. Yeah. Damn. I don't think we can get up to the cabin with the path block like this. Oh, no way am I going back to the lodge, a.k.a. Wax Museum, to drink hot chocolate with Emily. Ah! Ah! Jess! Fuck! Hey, Jessica! Yep! Hey! Um, okay! Holy crap, you scared the heck out of me. How do you think I felt? Uh, you didn't hit your head or anything. As far as I can tell, I still have all seven of my limbs. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can you get out? I... I don't know. I can hardly see anything down here. Alright, Jess, there's a cart. I think if you can push it, you can get by. All right. Okay, let me just try. It's too heavy. Hey, so, babe, you see the little gap down there? Between the cart and the wall? The tiny little gap? Yeah, maybe you can just, you know, like shimmy through it or something. <laughs> I appreciate your confidence in my physique, but I don't think the ladies are gonna fit. Oh, with the right. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, so why don't you either toss that light down or, you know, be a hero and jump down here to assist me? All right, don't move. I'm coming in. Better hurry up before some other hunky beefcake gets... <laughs> hey, handsome. Wanna help me move this cart thing? Not what I pictured. Oh, holy ah. crap! Ugh. 
I think this is where I'm going to end my yeah, video go right here. I'll pick it up we'll later. I hope you guys enjoyed what I did so far. And please like and subscribe. Thank you guys. Bye.